2012, the Sault Ste. Marie International Bridge marks 50 years joining the cities of Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario and Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan, the state of Michigan and the province of Ontario, and the United States and Canada. First open to traffic in October of 1962, the International Bridge has been a local link for commuters, students and shoppers and an international connection for tourism, manufacturing and global commerce for half a century. As with all big bridges, designers and builders of the International Bridge faced a daunting task. They needed not only to cross the St. Mary's River and the Sioux Locks, but integrate travel at both ends of the new bridge. A solution was needed, but a bridge in the current location wasn't the only possibility. And it provided for either a bridge or a tunnel. Well, the idea of a tunnel was uh, quickly dismissed, partly because of the cost of construction, but also for security reasons. Between 1953 and 1955, all the necessary state, provincial, and federal approvals were obtained. $16 million in bonds were issued in Michigan, half purchased by the province of Ontario to fund construction of the bridge. Designed by Steinman, Boynton, Gronquist, and London of New York, the 1.9-mile bridge incorporated a four-span, continuous arch design. Groundbreaking for the new bridge took place on September 16, 1960, and crews, half Canadian and half American, began work. On April 17, 1962, the two sides met in the middle of the span. While some traffic began to flow on the new bridge a few days earlier, the official opening date was October 31, 1962. The new International Bridge joining Canada and the United States at historic Sault Ste. Marie is a fitting symbol of the continued friendship, commerce, and cooperation between our two great countries. The Sault Ste. Marie International Bridge boasts a 50-year history, one of stewardship, cooperation, and international friendship. I believe that uh, the foundation that's been set in the last 50 years is really uh, we're going to help tremendously going into the future. Uh, we have to continue with forward planning. We have to build on the strengths that we have. So go look back at what's worked well and continue with that. Continue investing in our fantastic team. I'm pretty excited about it, the 50th anniversary. I said, you know, I mean, you take a look at this bridge and how beautiful it is. A key milestone in the life of any structure, let alone an international crossing. So we're really looking forward to gathering the communities together, our great nations, uh, our people together for a, a celebration of international friendship.